speed riders uh, we're not doing a ride today instead we're going to see a concert two very influential groups really rather unique in their approach to music and their approach to the genre they are going to see a band called Twin Temple and their uh, their rendition of a satanic orgy and I'm going to see the Bridge City Centers so we're in the car headed to Omaha Nebraska to the slowdown room should be a cool show I want to thank everybody for coming along let's get into it Nebraska. I'm sure the people here are really nice, but yeah, driving across this, this place is not. I'm happy we're here. There's some downtown Nebraska hidden above those interchanges. We'll see what else Nebraska has to offer. In downtown Omaha, uh, about to go to the Monster Club Pub and Grub. Should be a good time. Here in Omaha, Nebraska, at the Monster Club, getting a custom cocktail, the creature from the Black Lagoon. Check out this place. This restaurant downstairs, vinyl shop upstairs, exists in a part of Omaha known to locals as the Old Town. One very cool location and about to have a very cool drink. Got the creature from the Black Lagoon. Got the bar fit for a monster. Bleak rides, baby. Standing outside the famous slowdown venue. There it is in the background. Omaha, pretty mellow town been to a whole lot rougher this place is well taken care of people seem plenty friendly right around the corner we got some amazing pizza Rocco's Pizzeria y'all down here for a show at the slowdown check out Rocco's I won't do you wrong we rides down here in the pit at Twin Temple Bridge City Center show show hasn't started yet. Truly amazing show by the Bridge City Centers. I wish I could show you more, but copyrights and all that. Moving along to our headliner for the evening, the Twin Temples Satanic Orgy Tour. We'll see what it's about. We'll check it out. Not here to judge, just to observe. Hopefully we'll have some fun and see something interesting. In doing a little research on this group, I found that Twin Temple was founded about three years ago. The two members have been uh, slowly working on their act and building a YouTube presence and online presence and, you know, expanding their musical talent and putting together a tour. Very interesting showman and woman. Uh, definitely... A show not for the faint of heart. 
the ritualism and combination of 1950s satanic doo-wop music may not be for everyone. But it was an interesting sight to see, an interesting show to take in, and I have nothing but good things to say about Omaha's slowdown theater or the acts I've seen on this fateful evening. I can say without a shadow of a doubt, I had never seen a show quite like this. I've seen a band called Guar and the amazing scum dogs of the universe show they put on, spraying the audience with such things as ectochasm and cum. I've been to bands like Lamb of God, where the darkness and the guitars burning and the bass and the combination of the drums and the burning of the guitars and the bass made for music, most certainly played at the gates of hell. I've seen the actual Misfits, yeah, with Glenn Danzig as the frontman, play in Colorado. What an amazing show, right up my alley. Horror music, horror rock music. I go to all the shows I can, all the shows I didn't get to see when I was a kid. They just didn't come to Iowa. Now, being older, I can travel a bit. I can go see and experience different things. Try the local cuisine. If possible, ride on two wheels. But nevertheless, at the end of the day, the objective is always the same. To go places and experience things and broaden my state of mind about what the world around us is and continues to be. As always, Bleak Riders, I want to thank you all for coming along on the journey with me. You know, having friends and people to enjoy all the things the world has to offer, getting to share them with everybody, it really makes the journey that much sweeter. So thank you as always for coming along. I hope everybody out there is doing well. I got new things coming to the channel, new types of format. I'm going to start a, a gonzo news session. I'm going to try to do that once a week. Talking about motorcycle news. We're coming into winter here in the heartland. So my riding days are numbered. Might be able to squeeze something out on Sunday. A video I mean. We'll see. It's all still sort of up in the air. You know, uh, this has only been my first year at doing this. We'll see what year two holds. I'm excited to see what I learn. I'm excited to see what I get out to uh, observe and be a part of. Hopefully more bike events. Hopefully more concerts. Hopefully meeting the greatest people I, I've ever had the chance to in my lifetime. Uh, it's all been part of the motorcycle community. And um, I think that's all. Y'all be well. <laughs>